Hello kids. Welcome back to Doc June channel. Most of the time. Plants are the ones that get eaten. But every now and then. A plant gets revenge. Some plants are carnivores. This means that they eat meat. But. They certainly don't eat steak. But they're happy to feast on the occasional bug that crosses their path. Carnivorous plants are plants that eat insects and other small animals. Carnivorous plants grow in soil that has little nitrogen. All living things must have nitrogen. Thus, carnivorous plants get nitrogen from the insects they eat. First on the list are the Venus flytraps. Venus flytraps are probably the most famous carnivorous plants. These plants have a pair of thick, padded leaves that are covered with tiny hairs. When a fly or other tiny insect touches the hairs, snap, the leaves shut like two powerful jaws. The plant releases enzymes that break down the fly's insides into a soup. Dinner is served. Another popular carnivorous are the pitcher plants. A pitcher plant is also called as insect. Next on the list are the sundews. Sundews are flypaper plants that trap prey and sticky hairs on their leaves. They make up one of the largest groups of carnivorous plants. Long tentacles protrude from their leaves, each with a sticky gland at the tip. These droplets look like dew glistening in the sun, thus their name. The glands produce nectar to attract prey, powerful adhesive to trap it, and enzymes to digest it. Once an insect becomes stuck, nearby tentacles coil around the insect and smother it. Sundews can reach a height of up to 10 inches or 25 centimeters. However, some species are tall and with a vine-like appearance, while others hug the ground, making their size variable. So, whenever you see one of them in the field, at least by now you have background about them. And mind you kids there's still many carnivorous out there. I hope this short and simple explanation clears the doubts in your mind. Thank you for watching. If you have not subscribed our channel yet, please do subscribe for more videos. Thank you and God bless us all.